What's going on guys? Bringing you another spicy one today. Today I have Roth's Pretzels Grimm's Challenge. Now I don't actually know how spicy these are, but we have an ounce of pretzels here. I mean it's called Grimm's Challenge so I'd imagine they're sort of spicy. But we're going to find out. I'm going to open thing, these things up and uh, let you know what I think of these. Now this is like their hottest pretzel, I guess. Um, they do have just like snacking pretzels too. Also spicy. But I figured I'd get the uh, top of the list it has challenge in the name so I figured hey challenge so I don't really necessarily care that much for uh, for hard pretzels I like soft pretzels though but So you get some heat right away. Mm. Now there's no real challenge rules that I saw, but uh, I'm probably going to uh, maybe do like a five minute afterburn or something. No liquid while I'm eating these. No. They are, are sort of spicy. And they come inside a coffin, so. <laughs> Velvet line. They're pretty good, though. I could actually. So I don't like hard pretzels, really. But I could see me just snacking on these. A little bit of bite to them. Spicy challenges, dude. I'm thinking it's time to do a double hellfire. <laughs> a double hellfire, huh? Maybe. Doesn't seem like any of these things affect you. I think it's time to do a double hellfire. Since I, I don't think this is like an actual challenge, this is challenge pretzel. Tell me what you think of that. Tell me how hot it is. How hot it actually is? I would say it's pretty hot. They're spicy. Oh! <laughs> mm. Oh. <laughs> That's awful. Too hot? Oh, dude. <coughs> I don't think they're bad. I like them. I could actually see me sitting there eating them. That's too hot. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that bad? Quantity is my virtue, not spicy. Ugh. <sighs> I can't even like. Yeah. My nose isn't even running from these. Uh, Must not be Carolina Reaper. No. Down toward the dust in the bottom of the bag, it is uh, picking up some heat though. I think you should have a rub with dusty guys. Mm. 
this, I'll even clean the package out. gave him a piece like <laughs> but do uh do a little afterburn I guess I I don't think they're that spicy I kind of like them actually my tongue's on fire <sighs> Doing a five minute after burn too? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I mean, it's tolerable. It's not, I mean. It's tolerable. It's when, tolerable, but it's not, I mean. When you eat one little. One little sliver. Yeah. The heat's not my virtue. So, Ross Pretzels. Better step up their game because Andy Bolton just shut you down. They're spicy, but they're good. Now, <clears throat> on the ingredients list, it actually the only thing that it show, oh, the only thing that it shows is uh, red pepper on here. It's definitely hotter than red pepper, though. <laughs> yeah, I would say so. But I don't think they want you to know what's in there. It's a secret. Secret. Yeah. Their snacking pretzel, I think, is either two or three of these peppers that are on here. So we'll uh we'll say it it has to at least be ghost pepper in there. I can't remember that. At least has to be ghost pepper. You know if I start burping after a little bit <coughs> normally after a challenge if I burp and it's Carolina Reapers, I can tell that I ate Carolina Reapers. Just, they have that certain taste. So I won't really know right now, but... They don't really taste like peppers to just sit there and... I just taste Sit pain. there and try them. <laughs> you just taste pain. <laughs> you should definitely, if you like spicy, order some of these things. I kind of want to try their snacking pretzels just to see like the difference. I should have got them. Should have got a pack of each. There's a warning on the back too. Uh, yeah, should have read that. Should have read that. <laughs> Caution, some of our products are extremely hot, consume at your own risk. So if you can't handle heat, I wouldn't try them, but otherwise, I think they're good. Should give them a go. I wish these things came in like, you know, the normal size bag. Of course, they'd probably be pricey because I feel like this was something like eight dollars. So a full size bag of them would probably be a bit. Ross pretzels. Kind of want to look and see if I can find uh, what exactly. I was on the site before and <clears throat> I 
I didn't see what was actually in them. It just says uh, Grimm's Challenge when you go to order them. Uh, shop online. You can buy up to a three pound bag of uh, pretzels. They've got mild OG, it's like half a pepper, wasabi, garlic, horseradish, Savina. Dill, mustard, habanero, inferno, dragon's breath, scorpion, our Grimm's challenge. The next hottest is uh, Dragon's Breath. No, uh, no. The next hottest is Inferno. So I would say that Dragon's Breath would probably be their uh, like normal spicy snacking pretzel. Habanero, maybe. Oh, it actually has a description this time. Last time I looked, it wouldn't tell me. The only full plays with the Reaper. The Grimm's Challenge is made with our special Carolina Reaper extract. Experience pure, unadulterated, uh, unadulterated fire poured dying. <laughs> into the world's hottest pretzel. You already got your five minutes in. Good. 6.30. Good, can I get some milk now? Nine. <laughs> <laughs> So it is a Reaper. I didn't think it was that hot. Carolina Reapers seem hotter than that normally. But, that's the Grimm's, Grimm's Challenge. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I think you should go out and get yourself a box of these. Try them out. I think you should just go get some Snayers pretzels. Ixnay the Grimm's. Ixnay. But, Thanks for watching. S share, subscribe uh, to my uh, channel if uh, you haven't already. It's free. It is free. I'll put a link to uh, Roth's pretzels in my description. Make sure you stop in and check them out and get some pretzels. Eat some spicy things. Catch you guys next time.